What's up, YouTube? Best Uber driver in San Francisco, at least in my opinion, back. Uh, just cruising around out here in Oakland. Uh, it's been really, really slow in the city today. Uber has still got those stupid uh, split bonuses going on. But uh, seems to be some controversy about the uh, President Trump executive order. Uh, which has caused uh, some people to what's trending now on Twitter is delete delete your hashtag delete your Uber account um, supposedly on this rumor based upon uh, if you check Randy Uberman out um, that Uber was helping Trump with that by turning off surge pricing and um, surge pricing and boost pricing at JFK while the, the cabbies were protesting. Uh, Randy already did a video on that. I'm not going to get into that, but uh, that's caused an outcry. Monday was a, yesterday was a decent day. Uh, today has been incredibly slow, untypical for a Tuesday. As a matter of fact, I was going to do a I was going to do a video about how Tuesday has become the new Monday because people are saying, you know what, Monday is just too crazy. So what I'm going to do is slide my week. I'll start it on Tuesday. Well, now Tuesday is is crazy. Monday tends to be a um, commuting-wise is okay. But getting back to the protest, I don't know uh, what traffic is done. I don't know if Uber or Lyft has statistics on it. I'm sure they do. But they should be able to tell you if traffic's down or not. So... I'm just basically uh, driving around. I'm going to areas that are, say, less politically active. So San Francisco would be one that's politically active. So that's why they're down. Berkeley, another place politically active. So where do you go? You go to Oakland. You go to Piedmont. You go to some of the, shall we say, more Republican-leaning areas are less likely to uh, protest. Still get business people going to the airport. Um, I was down in Silicon Valley today, too. Um, Palo Alto, Mountain View, took some people to Google, took some people over to Microsoft. So, but then that kind of dried up after this morning. So, it's interesting. Uh, so I'm rattling on. So yeah, hit me back. Tell me, uh, let me know if it's if the protests are affecting Uber in your town. Hopefully, you all have subscribed to this channel, so you're checking this out. Um, but hopefully, you uh, you know you'll take a look around and find out what's going on in your neck of the woods. How's it affecting the airport? How's it affecting uh, the number of riders? Are people deleting their accounts? Because this could actually could be a game changer. Once again, Uberman said no, he didn't think so. But uh, even if even if just 10% of the people delete their Uber accounts, for a company to see a 10% change in anything quickly, like within a couple days or within a week, they start panicking. So I'm not sure what's going to happen, but uh, hey, we'll find out together. So until next time, be safe out there. I guess, what, what did I say, Uber on? Okay, Uber on.